Okay, a uh, very quick video just to uh, show you today's latest find. Uh, ooh, lighting's going a bit weird. It's a Hitachi um, turntable, direct drive turntable. And the model number, if we can see it, it's a little bit dark, but it's actually an HT40S. These were made. Uh, in the early 80s I would say anywhere between maybe 80 and 82 something like that um, it's direct drive it's got uh, got the stroboscope there so it's not actually uh, quartz locked it uses the frequency of the mains power well that's fine, the speed adjust works fine, the speed is very very stable the return and the arm lift works well uh, unfortunately when I got it there was a uh, cartridge on it that was like a kind of a an unnamed blank audio technical lookalike and it was broken so uh, I've replaced it with this cartridge I've had for a little while. This is a JVC cartridge that was made in, I think, the, the early to mid 70s. And it was designed for a long forgotten record for, format called CD4 that was actual four channels from a, from a vinyl record. And uh, this was JVC's own uh, design of cartridge and uh, it's got a very very expensive kind of um, diamond stylus on it called a Shibata and they are um, very sought after uh, and I've got to say I've set it up and I've got to say, it sounds fantastic. I'm not going to play anything because I don't want the copyright police getting on my case. But believe me, that cartridge and that stylus makes your records sound like heaven. I would say it's the best cartridge that I've heard. And I've heard maybe about five, so... Uh, but they've all been really good ones, and this is the best of the bunch. Uh, there's a the tiny little stylus it's like a grain of dust it's so small um, really pleased with this for a very 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 low price uh, you don't find many turntables these days it's a long time since I uh, found a turntable in fact the last one that I found at the same thrift store was this one it was a Technics SLQ200. These quartz lock Technics turntables are absolutely fabulous. If you ever see one for sale at a yard sale or a thrift store, buy it up right away because they're fantastic. Uh, this one had no top. It was full of what looked like uh, drywall dust. It took a lot of cleaning and it works perfectly lovely arm as well beautiful engineered arm the Hitachi not quite as well engineered but still a cut above it's about a mid-range turntable that and that of course is uh, a dual 1019 which I frankenized it's uh, it dates from between 1963 and 1969 because I've used parts from both years in there so uh, it's a good mixture once again very great turntable but very takes a lot of uh, a lot of maintenance to keep it going so that's it first new turntable in years really maybe about three years probably very pleased with it so that's it see you next time bye